We are AirCharger, the smaller, easier, and more convenient way to charge your phone. Now I will present to you our management team. No, you go. Sorry, go ahead. So we have um, Elizabeth Grace Lively, who was our CEO. Um, as my name is Esmeralda Cavazos, and I'm our COO. We have Gabby um, Nix, who is our CFO, um, followed by Gala Gutierrez, who is our um, CCO, Leslie Beltran, who is our CMO, and Riara Evans, who is our CTO. Now, we're going to show a team of the team. Ah, oh, no team. Oh, oh, addressing is one that I'm sure all of you have faced, and that is the inconvenience of phone chargers. So the cords are often too short, making it hard to use while it's charging, um, or it will break, or it comes unplugged while you're charging it. Broken phone chargers actually lead to over 54,000 metric tons of waste each year. And the, air, the, um, the wireless chargers are not much better because you can't use the phone while it's charging, so it's very difficult. But air charger is the solution. So we have the block that plugs into the wall, which sends energy to the pad that goes on the back of the phone. This means that as long as your phone is within 10 feet of the block, it will keep charging. So no more forgetting to plug in your phone, no more coming back to find out that your phone has been unplugged and isn't charged, no more tripping over phone cords. All right, I'm gonna turn it over to Ezra now. Now who are we um, targeting with this product? We're targeting ages from 15 to 35, who are willing to try new tech, students who are on the go, and young professionals who are looking for more efficient solutions. Now, as you can see here, we collected 150 responses, and more than 80% are more than likely to buy this product since they found it very useful. Now, <clears throat> awareness, with our awareness, we plan to like promote it through Instagram, Facebook, and TikTok. As well, we have set money aside in our marketing to promote it through like um, streaming services that have ads, as well as like our website, which will be our main distribution, followed and hope to expand to Amazon, Best Buy, Walmart, and Target. Now, now, despite our product being very unique and new to the market, we still face competition. Apple has just recently reduced, um, released a product called the Battery Part Pack, which is similar to our product, but the only main difference is that their product requires the battery pack to be charged beforehand. Our product does not require you to do so. Belkin and Anchor are, simi are very similar in which they have wireless charging. However, they still they require your, for you to set your phone down to charge. Now I'll pass it on to Grace for the financials. All right, I'm gonna take you through our year one revenue. So we're expecting to get 0.007% of the market which might sound a little bit small, but the reason for that number is we're taking the first part of the year for research and development, and for the rest of the year, we do still have to build brand awareness. Um, so this number leads us to 10,000 units for the first year. At $75 per unit, we're going to have a revenue of $750,000 in the first year. And now I'll lead you through our cost and our profit. So our cost is broken up into four pieces. 
First, we have $100,000 set aside for research and development. You can see that here. Our inventory is $147,600, which is about $30 per unit um, minus a certain amount for mass production. Our marketing is $70,000, and Esmer talked a little bit about how that's broken up. And then our administrative costs are $110,000, and that's going to cover things like customer service or warehousing. So this leaves you with a cost of $427,000, um, and this is what we're asking for. And if you subtract this from our first year revenue, we get a profit of $322,400 in the first year. All right, so our goals for the future. Um, first of all, I'm gonna point out that our break even point is 5,701 units. And like I mentioned, we should reach that in the first year. In our second year, we're expecting to grow quite a lot. First, because we don't have to take time for research and development. And One second, because we will have brand awareness already. Um, and our market share should double. So this will take us from 0.007% to 0.14% by the second year. All right, so thank you so much for listening. Please invest in AirCharger and energize the future.